Hi there, I'm Anthomnia the Sleepless Gamer and today we are doing a dossier on the Dung Beetle. Now before we begin this dossier, I would just like to thank you guys so much for all of the liking and the sharing of the video content. It has been going great so far. Let's see if we can smash our average of 40 likes on this video and maybe get even higher. That would be absolutely amazing. Wild. What magic created the Dung Beetle? I cannot say. What I can say is that this creature is perfect for advanced human tribes. It eats mostly useless waste, known as feces, and then it metabolizes this waste into a more refined waste product, along with an oily byproduct. The oily byproduct is chemically the same as oil found in the oceans around the island. Somehow, the dung beetle converts feces into oil. If that wasn't reason enough to worship the dung beetle, the refined waste product is almost identical to fertilizer from a compost bin. That is pretty badass. I think everyone and their mom is going to have a dung beetle. Domesticated. The dung beetle makes me think humans have been on this island for a long time. Why else would a creature evolve to be such a perfect pet? Most tribes jealously protect their dung beetles, whom are handily tamed with the skilled use of some well-handled feces. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, I don't want to throw crap at those things. I'm not picking up my own crap and like trying to feed it to something. That's gross. These wondrous little organic biofactories are truly a sustainable, green, eco-friendly source of the resource for living off the island. Oil becomes gas, which is generator fuel. Fertilizer means crops which is human fuel. The dung beetle can power all aspects of the island's life. All around, I see this dung beetle as being something vital to higher up tribes that are into the end game content. It's really gonna make it a lot easier to get the stuff that you need to run the equipment that you're gonna have around your base, but at the same time, it might make the game too easy to have all of this stuff easily accessible. Let me, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Personally, I am for and against because, well, I am for it because it seems to make the game a little bit easier and it's less tedious going out into the ocean and having to mine for a couple hours to get your oil. But at the same time, it also removes that immersive experience you get of, okay, well, we have this, we need to get this oil. We're going to go out and get the oil that's in the ocean. Let me know what you guys think about that. And that's basically it for this video. Once again, if you do enjoy these dossiers and you want to see more dossiers like this, please remember to smash that like button. Every single like helps the channel grow a ton and I cannot thank you guys enough. We've been smashing an average of 30 to 40 likes and I would love to see this dossier smash 40 likes if possible. Anyways, that's it for this video. Thank you so much once again for watching. I'm Anthomnia the Sleepless Gamer, and if you are new to the channel, subscribe today to feed that late night video addiction.